Hey Stray fans, am I an influencer? Well, I don't know about that, but a few different companies have sent me some products recently, so this video I'm going to review some gear. I'm not getting paid by any of these companies, just thought I'd share my thoughts on the products they sent me. So, First up, we have these awesome pants that I'm wearing right now. Uh, they are from the brand Cool. These are hiking pants, uh, but yeah, this brand right here, cool. I've never actually tried them before, so I was excited when they wanted to send me these pants. Um, they're super lightweight. This is called the Renegade, uh, this uh, pant type. Love the color, love the feel. They're super comfortable. They got nice uh, mesh pockets, keep them lightweight. Uh, I have run them through the wash already and they've come out fine. I didn't even read the tag about how I'm supposed to wash them because when I'm out hiking, sometimes you're staying in town at a hostel or whatever and the laundry machines don't have special features and tumble dry low and all that stuff. So you just got to wash with whatever you got. So I just threw these in normal wash, put them in the dryer, probably on high heat. I don't know. They came out fine. So that's important to me for when you're hiking because you don't always have good options when it comes to washing machines and dryers but yeah these are great and they look awesome so you don't even have to you know be hiking to wear these I actually just you know you could wear them just you know out and about uh, so really excited about these actually because on the Appalachian Trail I was using these Columbia convertible hiking pants they definitely have given me some problems this is actually the second pair I had to return one because the stitching is really bad and this one, the stitching on the pocket has already ripped again. So it's just, you know, Columbia's, it's fine, but the cool definitely feels a lot, a lot better quality. I would definitely recommend them. They also sent me these cool stickers. So speaking of stickers, this is really isn't a gear review, um, but there is a Instagram user named abstract.hikes. Her name's Alina. She's an artist on Instagram and she actually makes stickers from her artwork. She sent me these stickers that she made of me. It's actually a silhouette I sent her of me on the Appalachian Trail. And so she did that artwork and gave me these stickers, which is super awesome. I've not actually met Alina, but she seems so cool from our conversations on Instagram, um, but she does a ton of artwork online and she takes commissions, love her stuff. So definitely recommend checking her out. Next up on the gear review, we have this bear bag, which actually features my kind of a Stray Life logo on the bag. This is from the brand Hilltop Packs. So it's a bear bag, food bag. There's their brand right there, Hilltop Packs. Now they are a family owned company and they sent me this bear bag made out of Dyneema. And a little bit about their company, so don't forget, but a yeah, family owned business. They have a two year warranty, which is pretty awesome. So two year warranty on them. They just seem like a great company, you know, always like supporting, you know, the smaller businesses. Uh, but yeah, you can basically, um, the bear bags, you can upload your own photo and they will print it on the bag. Unfortunately, I did not use their uploader online that um, I guess you can see what it looks like because I probably would have moved, moved the photo up a little bit. Um, but you can do that. You can upload your own photos online and see how they look before you order the bag, which is not what I did. I just sent in a picture. So I would recommend doing that. But this is the large uh, bear bag that they have, the food bag. It is 12 to 13 liters, but super lightweight, um, great quality. Um, but just super cool. Got the picture on both sides. Um, previously, when I was on Te Aroa and Appalachian Trail, I was using like a Sea to Summit bag, which I've used two of these actually, and both times I get holes and I end up having to duct tape them. Um, I can't really compare the weight between these two. This one obviously feels heavier, but this is a much bigger bag anyways. This is a uh, 20 liter. This one, which is the 12 to 13, which is their large. I think they have larger sizes. I just don't know if the larger sizes you can print stuff on. I'm not sure, but full pack packs, super cool. Love it. So thank you so much. But yeah, you know, your normal food bag, you've got, you know, your stove, you've got your food, all that stuff. So this is super awesome, which would be great for my PCT hike that I didn't get to do. So I'll definitely need a bear bag to hang up in the trees. But lastly, I got some socks from this brand Fitz. There you go, Fitz. So 
I've only used like Darn Tough and then just REI brand socks and some other socks that I didn't know the brand for hiking in. But Fitz is an awesome brand. They have been very recommended by my friends. So when they wanted to send me some socks, I was super excited. And they have tons of cool designs. So I picked out these ones with the little trees on them. And I did already do a 16 mile hike with these and I haven't been hiking in months. So 16 miles was a big day for me and I didn't get any blisters. I was actually thought for sure I'd get some blisters just because I hadn't hiked in a while. But these guys were awesome, this, this pair of socks. And I did throw them through the wash and I forgot you should, you should like turn them inside out. But these guys held up, it's just a little, little fuzzy on the outside now. Super good quality. They sent me another pair as well, which has this cool little mountain design on these ones. These are the light hiker crew, but they have other thicknesses if you want, you know, a thicker sock, different lengths for, for how high they go up your ankle or not. Tons of different products on their website. Definitely recommend them. Worked out super well when I was up on Franconia Ridge, which I'll be posting that video shortly so you can check out my hike in the White Mountains. That's all the gear I have to review today. So thanks for watching. Be sure to check out these brands. I almost forgot to plug my own gear. If you like this t-shirt, be sure to check out astraylife.com where I got this t-shirt, other artwork, other t-shirts and more. So thanks for watching.